<laughs> what up y'all and welcome back to another one you now you can tell i'm at walmart here hope the wind isn't too bad getting ready for a pigeon hunt and y'all have been asking me a ton bobby what ammo do you use so i was like i just got sick of describing it i was like i buy my ammo from walmart guys for pigeon hunts dove hunts i buy it from walmart so i decided to uh open the video up check this out look how small it is yeah never doubt yourself that's what i always say right yeah it's too small i think it's made for an infant oh wonder how awkward this is gonna be i got you all on the gopro just because i knew it would uh be a lot more low key especially with all this covid stuff going on but before we get into today's video and into walmart i want to tell y'all that today's video is sponsored by ducks waterfowl that new t-shirt of the month check it out right here i will link the ducks t-shirt of the month down in the description below go sign up it is the cheapest t-shirt we offer so first off i always have a lot of people ask bobby you say you get your shells from walmart but how do you kill as many as you do guys you got to have a full choke a long range choke first of all and seven and a half shot lead goes perfect with a full choke it patterns beautifully so i always urge my viewers if you haven't tried a full choke try to get used to it that way your smaller lead shot for dove pheasant uh pigeons it's more effective let's go check out the price check that out 100 rounds 1956 so for the same price this is the difference guys don't get the seven and an eighth ounce for the same price get the ounce and an eighth yes it doesn't matter if it's seven or eight shot that don't matter get the ounce and an eighth for the same price as the seven and eight that's a big deal <laughs> i got the uh, last two boxes yes always pay attention to what ounce that bad boy is always get the bigger ounce load if you're gonna spend the money especially if it's the same price y'all you got to oh pivot tracks Whew. well we are pulling out of the field that didn't take long it's right at 6 30 sitting at 73 degrees y'all if you can get out in the mornings for a pigeon hunt that's the time to do it on the last uh, pigeon hunt y'all seen jordan and i which he's here we got old jordan behind us pivot tracks are a nightmare on a truck uh but 73 degrees a beautiful morning if y'all can get out on a morning hunt and do it the afternoons like that last video jordan and i did oh my goodness it was a scorcher this this is nice i wish i had fred with me today uh we're going to north dakota for early honker season again oh yeah with dirty bird outfitters gerald's going brad's going it's gonna be a good time dive bombs going i think we'll be pulling up the sherp lots to come y'all the season is literally right upon us but we're gonna walk in here i'm probably gonna uh leave the big camera in the truck and we're gonna rock the shot cam and the gopro dude in my neck face you dude well. so i'm sitting here talking met some new buddies here got shot you mind if i put it on the youtube channel hold on let's see that again this is just for saved hey this is a what happens so this is what happens tell him a little story uh we were just messing around and he uh -oh. shot a blank round at me he and thought it was his buddy thought it was a blank round oh my goodness dude <laughs> so luckily you had your side turned to the shot yep and how how what was the yardage me to the decoys Oh my god. <laughs> Too close for coming. Literally 15, yeah. 10 yards. Maybe. <laughs> I guarantee you won't do that again. Nope. Won't happen again. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, yeah, that's not funny at all. It's but uh, oh yeah yeah yeah. Well that's a learning teaching moment for sure. That was a learning moment, I'm sure, yeah. Uh just a little reminder, gun safety, y'all. Gun safety, gun safety, you know. I try to preach it. We all make dumb decisions sometimes in our life. But uh, here we go. Got old Tristan, it's been a little bit. I guess it's been since the last pigeon hunt. Yeah. That wasn't uh, only about, what, two weeks ago? Three weeks Three ago. Three weeks ago. Brought your dog, though. Yeah. How old? He's ready. Nine. Nine years old. He's nine. The old trooper of the land. My goodness. Kind of nice sitting next to a dog. It's been a while. I'm missing Fred. Missing Fred pretty bad. Boy, howdy, we got starlings all over us. We're still talking about, 
What's your name? What's your first name? Jarrett. Jarrett. I knew that. Uh, still talking about his shooting incident here. So it was on the news and everything, and they labeled it teen shooting. What all? To tell them what all was wrong with you again. Oh, I had it hit me in the pancreas and the kid, both my kidneys, and just it peppered me right by my jugular, my face, and up in my sinuses. It was. So, just question: What type of gun was it? It was a 12 gauge. A 12 gauge. With what seven size? and a half? Seven and a half shot, yeah. just like a dove load, like mm -hmm. we're using today. Was there like a full choke or was it just a stock choke? It was Do you just, remember? Uh, I think it was just a modified. Oh my god, that's <laughs> so scary. Yeah. Oh, God. I got kids out here, okay? I got kids. You're scaring me out here, dude. My Lord, be careful, y'all. Uh, the season's coming, and um, gun safety, gun safety, gun safety. Remind yourself. Come on now. We got some pigeons hitting the, hitting the field here. If we get a shot at all, we'll have to spray if they don't do it. There we go. There we go. Three... Two, one, two. <laughs> that was awesome. Coming over the top, hold on. That was sweet. Back. That was good. Sit down, big boy. Sit down. Here we go. Next group. Here we go, boys. Reapers do a little bit better than that traffic hunt. Three, two, one, go. Yeah, we tore him up there. That was good shooting. Hold on this red one. See this red one here? Yeah, in the back. Shoot that red one if he comes close. Yeah. Here, you're coming back. Get ready, boys. All Shoot this red, red one. one. Three, two, one. Shoot him. Me and you are pulling the trigger every time, exact same time. We all were shooting at one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, well, I'm out of shells. Woo! That's a rally, boy. That is a rally. Shoot him. I'm, I'm empty. Yeah, hold on. Yeah, they're coming back. They're coming back. Good dog. That was awesome. We got a pretty one down. We got a nice red one at, down out there. Yeah, buddy. I'm going to tell you what. He's right here. Federal. Oh, my goodness. You guys want it to depend on something right there. Good stuff. Two on the left. Two on the left. Guys, come on. Nothing. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. That was a rally, dude. That was a freaking rally. Look at that, dude. That's a beauty, dude. What an absolute stud muffin that is. That's a young bird. Check out, check out how young that bird is. Beauty. He just floated back. These pigeons, man. It's like they're, they're not pressured at all. They'll just get shot at, they'll turn around, they'll come back. That's fun. That's a lot of fun. If you guys are liking the video, you know what to do. Smash the thumbs up button. Pigeon hunting's back. Oh God, in front, in front. Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. <laughs> oh my goodness. That was awesome. <laughs> Woo! Get ready, they're gonna swoop back, guys. Load up, don't go get birds, just load up. Dead can lay out there. Oh, they're all flopping. <laughs> yeah, we just smoked them. We just smoked them. Fine, back. Dead bird, go. 
trying to get feathers. Oh, that was awesome. Well, I looked up and I was like, oh, God, shoot him, boys. <laughs> oh, that's a killed. Yeah. Huh. Whew. Well, this might be a good one, boys. I just dumped the whole tube. I was just like, boom, 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 boom. Well, we got to fix some decoys here. You know me, always out here fixing decoys. Um, one thing, guys, notice, notice, like I said last one, I'm not using mojos anymore on pigeon hunting. They hate it. They, uh, they're they doing it so much better without the mojos, for sure. But we got into them really well. We're gonna have to band check at the end of this Big thing. Road. Big, Big come on, let's go, let's go. Oh boys, get ready. No, dude, it's too alive. Here we go, there's a white wing in there. Get ready. Three, two, one, go. Oh. 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 Sucker. <laughs> oh, he got the long one. Oh, yeah, good dog. Coming back. Nice. Sweet. This is good. This is a good one, boys. That's a good old dog. Look, he bringing him back to me. Why is he bringing him? Good. Bring him to your dad, man. <laughs> Not me. I'm dogless today. I didn't see where he I got dropped at. Kennel. He gets so into it. <laughs> He's doing good though for his age, man. We're gonna get to rain these bad. Let let them get in tight. Hold your britches, boys. Hold on, hold on. No, no, no. Sit, sit down. Three, two, one, go. Go down. Dude, I just smacked that bird right in his face when he was coming. Holy smoke. So, one thing about these birds, you can be very, very patient. You know, let them get in there. Let them keep coming. Let them fall off and kill them. Oh, that's awesome. Here we go. Look at this. I see a white winger in there. Get ready. They're going to do it fast. He's bringing them in. Hold up. Let them work a little bit. Hi, bird. Coming over the back. Okay. Yeah, they're going to do it. Ready. Shoot them. I didn't lead them near enough. Good dog. Good dog. My bird. My bird. Go. Oh, oh, watch out for my glasses, son. Damn, that's a young bird. No wonder he decoyed two different times. Oh, that's a dog. That's a good boy. Nine years old, just a trucking. That's a good dog. Hold on, hold on. Uh, uh, uh. There. Mm, yep. Shoot him. Go down. There we go. Ah. Wow. <laughs> I didn't know how to read that one. Oh my 
We definitely didn't wait. I was like, we're... Yeah, this group kind of wants to come back again. Oh, that's a good dog. My, my bird. Oh, nope, Dad's bird. That's a dog. That's an older looking blue check there. Yeah, he's a lot older. Check out his eyes. Whoa, easy. Dispatch. Good group. Good group. This is a real good group. Let them, we're going to let them tighten up. There we go. Oh, yeah, there's two pretty birds in here. We'll smoke these four. Ready, three, two, one, go. Yep, the white one got away. Oh. Right here, coming over. Nice shot. I wanted that white one. I shot all three rounds at that white one. My bird. I don't know, we got quite a bit. That's what I was just going to check. Old Gunny, he's brought me back all these, dude. We gotta go out. We gotta go add to the spread out here. It's going good. I think uh, if I had to guess, I don't know. I think we got down probably 20. Right, probably right at 20. It's going good. It's a fun one. Yeah, two starlings. But just adding to the spread out here, y'all. Dead pigeons are the best decoy. Well, we got blood on the lens. Wow, we got blood on the lens. A little wild out here, but I want to do this. You guys seem to like it. We're gonna go through what type of gun you're rocking right here. A Browning A5. Browning A5. How long you had it? Uh, I think it's two years now. That's not the gun that you got shot with, right? No, it's not. <laughs> you knew I was gonna bring it back yeah. up. <laughs> Browning A5. You've had it for how long? Two years. And you love it. Yeah, I love it. Wouldn't you wouldn't switch right now? No. You're sold. I'm sold. What do you got over here? Stoger M3000. Stoger M3000. Dude, you would not believe. What choke do you got there? That's in uh, mid-range. Carlson mid-range? Nope, just standard cam with the gun. Oh, so that's a stock extended mid-range. Mid exactly. Stoger M3000. A ton of you. I th Honest to God, out of the most popular gun on the channel, it's that one. For sure. Gotta be. I tell you. I'll tell you what. It's a go-to oh. for a semi-automatic for not having to spend a whole lot of money. Right. How much did that cost you? Seven fifty off the shelf, brand new, about seven years ago. I'll be darn. And Never had a problem with it, huh? Nope. I've had it rebuilt once on my innards, and other than that, it's a, it's a dream for me. I love it. Had a lot of people ask about the Stoger M3000. You ever shot an M3500? I have, and I always stick with. The, I don't believe in the extra three and a half inch. You know, stick with just the three. No, I know. I, I hear you. In your face. I hear you. I hear you. Going down the line. Is that the Montefeltro? Yep. I knew you were going to say it. They've seen your gun already. Yeah. You had to get a new choke though, huh? Yeah. It's still a Power Master Goose Code. Oh, black, black. black. Yeah. Code black. Code black. Let's go on down to the bearded man. What do you write? You're got, you brought some something different, a little something something. What do you got here? This here is a throwback. This is my first one ever. This is an 870. A good old Remington 870. Pump. Good old pump. Pump. Does the 870 shoot three and a half? This one does. Oh. This is a, the special purpose. The 870 is probably between the Stoger and that. That's definitely more of the. Oh, everyone has. I guarantee you, everybody's had one of those. Yeah. What else did you bring? Uh, I haven't shot it yet, but I brought the 20 gauge. Ooh, semi auto 20 gauge. The Youth 1100. That's what I want. I want to get a semi auto 20 gauge. That's one of the next guns I'm going to have to buy. And the 28 gauge. I haven't forgot about the 28 gauge. I gotta find a nice one. Well, this is our first group that we've seen in probably 30 minutes. See if it works. Oh, it's gonna work. Ready? Three, two, one, go! Ah, I was. I only had three shells in my gun, and I didn't shoot anything. That was great. Single just dive bombing. Hang on, hang on. Shoot him. <laughs> well, look at this. Group out front. Oh, there's a big one. Oh, there's two white ones that in there. That poor single, he got hit hard. Oh, get, get down. Got here, here, here. Heel, got him. Heel. Come on, buddy. Right here. This this single here. Let him, in, let him get in here. Bobby, shoot him. Shoot him. Three behind it. He did.
Well, pulling back into the field. Uh, it's time to pick up right at 8.30 in the morning. Uh, pigeon hunts, AM pigeon hunts do not last very long, y'all. Uh, they get in there early, 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 and it's done. I will tell you though, it was nice. Uh, we didn't pile a bunch up. I don't know how many we have on the ground, to be honest. We'll get a count here in a minute. But it, but it was such a nice hide. We had the sun to our backs, 70, 75 degrees out this morning beautiful weather i wanted to remind y'all we do have the first trip of the season coming up y'all north dakota honkers it's gonna be amazing you do not want to miss those videos they're gonna be epic this is a thing y'all this is a thing if you have a bunch of wads in one pile like we did all of the wads were literally right here don't only pick up your empties try to pick up your wads see look you found two more right there didn't you oh another one that's a thing it's it's a thing might not be a hole but it's still plastic yep well check it out not a bad shoot whatsoever two pretty ones red and an old grizzly uh 37 total pretty good hunt not bad at all cannot complain about it the first groups that uh that came they did it some of the best decoy pigeons uh that we've had all summer we did that in under two hours yeah we have not been out here very long no like this was not an all-day thing it, it went quick yeah i can't complain it's not even hot yet we've had much worse hunts so <laughs> <laughs> yeah there's we've made some videos before I, I know i've made pigeon hunt videos before where we only killed like seven or ten so i'm happy with it check this out real quick hold on stand in the sun there you go like that look at that he shot that last year. A year to the date, it was banded. A uh, dove. Uh, dove, over so. In, uh, Burton. Over a really? Yeah. Wow. I've never seen a dove band. <laughs> Me either. You are one lucky man. I am. I'm the 15th person in the state of Kansas to do it. Really? Did my research. In the history? And since they started banding there's dove. Only, there's only 15 people in Kansas, that and you're one of them. Dove, yeah. We met a guy that got shot, a guy that shot a dove band. My goodness. Yeah, that's a lucky band, dude. Yeah. That's, that's something. That's something. That's it, one in. It was the one bird of the day, too. Dude, you gotta think like that's one in 10 million, 30 million that might be 50 million dove that might be in Kansas at that time. Pretty special. Pretty special. <laughs> oh well, look who it is. Well, hi there, big boy. Come here, heel. Good. He's a sweet boy. Look at him. Old Frederick, he wasn't on this hunt with us, but Tristan's dog was nine years old. What a trooper, you know? One heck of a hunt, 40 birds down. Uh, guys, I want to remind you guys, the North Dakota honker hunts, I am leaving in like T minus two days, three days, something like that. And I am going to try to pump out as many videos as I possibly can for you guys. So be expecting that. Number two, old Frederick, He's probably not gonna go to North Dakota with us. I was thinking he might, but he needs to get back to the trainer. Pretty much for the rest of September, he needs to be at the trainer. He needs to be, there's some things he needs some work on still, but he's, he's a good boy. He's doing real good in training. I do wanna remind you that duck seasoning is available. And let me tell you what, I've been putting it on everything. Not only my wild game, my steaks, my boogers, everything, my corn, my potatoes on the grill, it's amazing. If you haven't tried it, it's very cheap. It's on the duckswaterfowl.com website. I will link it down in the description as well as that new fast food ducks t-shirt of the month, baby. This is a good old throwback, a little revamped. It looks a lot better than the first fast food uh, teal shirt that we had. If you want to pick any of these items up, this hat, it'll be available on the big drop August 20th. August 20th, August 20th, put it in your head. A ton of new ducks merch coming as well as all the duck calls and goose calls as well. But I want to thank you all for being here. Hit the notification bell right down there because it'll notify you when your boy uploads. But more importantly, guys, please, I showed you the uh, Jarrett, the kid y'all met that got shot. That was a, that was a very dumb, um, I don't want to say accident. They thought that they had a blank in their gun and he was going to shoot his buddy. His buddy was going to shoot him with a blank. Well, it turned out it wasn't a blank. So 
Gun safety, gun safety, gun safety, gun safety. Do not point, do not point your gun at other human beings. Just do not do that. Make sure your gun is on safety at all times. Uh, make sure that when you're wielding your gun, when you're holding it in the field, that you have the best interest of everybody around you. You know what I'm saying? Gun safety, gun safety. I'm gonna keep saying. But subscribe if you haven't. We'll see y'all on the next one. Peace. I've been getting laid back, baby. You should know that. I don't need your criticism, pessimism. I've been keeping it on the DL. Got a girl. That